and welcome to the Daily Vigil Bible. Number 8. Join Lent, I have given myself a challenge of entering the strange world of the kitchen and baking every day. These attempts are recorded and uploaded to my new channel on YouTube called Robbie's Kitchen. Needless to say that I am finding it tricky to balance both this channel and the new one, so I hope you will bear with me during this period. Today we are reading Joshua 15. Let's open God's word of prayer. Lord, I ask as I read your word, that you reveal something new to me. I also ask as people hear your word, they come to better understanding of you. Amen. The lot for the tribe of the children of Judah, according to their families, was to the border of Edom, even to the wilderness of Zin southward, at the uttermost parts of the south. The south border was from the uttermost parts of the salt sea, from the bay that looked southward. They went out southward, of the ascent of Akarabim, and passed along to Zin, and went up by the south of Kadesh, Barney, and passed along by Ezron, went up to Adda, and turned towards Karka, and it passed along to Asmon, went out of the book of Egypt, and the border ended at the sea. This shall be your south border. The east border was the salt sea, even to the end of the Jordan. The border of the north quarter was from the bay of the sea at the end of the Jordan. The border went up to Beth Hogla and passed along by the north of Baeth Arba. And the border went up to the stone of Bohan, the son of Reuben. The border went up to Deba from the barley of Akor and so northward, looking toward Gagal that faces the ascent of Adumin, which is on the south side of the river. The border passed along to the waters of En Shemesh and ended at En Rogel. The border went up by the valley of the son of Himnom to the side of the Jezebrisites, also called Jerusalem, southward. And the border went up to the top of the mountain that lies before the valley of Himnom, westward which is at the furthest part of the valley of Rephaim, northward. The border extended from the top of the mountain to the spring of the waters of Naphtoah, and went out to the cities of Mount Ephron, and the border extended to Paola, also called Karaf, Jerim, and the border turned about from Bela westward to Mount Seir, and passed along to the side of Mount Jerim also called Shashalon, on the north and went down to Beth Shemesh, and passed along by Timnah, and the border went out to the side of Ekron northward, and the border extended to Shekharon, and passed along to Mount Bala, and went out at Jabneel, and the goings out of the border were at the sea. The west border was to the shore of the great sea. This is the border of the children of Judah according to their families. He gave to Caleb the son of Jephunneh a portion among the children of Judah according to the commandments of Yahweh to Joshua, even Kiraph Harba, named after the father An Anak, as they called Hebron. Caleb drove out the three sons of Anak, Shisha, and Haman and Tamai, the children of Anak, he went up against the inhabitants of Deba. And the name of Deba before it was Kerath, Shifra, Caleb said, He who strikes Kerath, Sheba, and takes it, to him I will give Hakshar, my daughter's wife. Ophniel, the son of Kinas, the brother of Caleb, took it, and he gave him Hakshar, his daughter's wife. When she came, she had asked her father for a field. She got off of her donkey, and Caleb said, What do you want? She said, Give me a blessing, because you have sent me in the land of the south. Give me also springs of water. So he gave her the upper springs and the lower springs. This is the inheritance of the tribe of the Judah and the Judah, according to their families. The furthest cities of the tribe of the children of Judah, toward the border of Edom in the south, 
Mukabzil, Ada, Jagger, Kina, Dibna, Adada, Kadesh, Hazel, Ifna, Zif, Dalem, Bilof, Azul, Abta, Kirov, Azul, Ozakor, Azul, Amon, Shima, Morada, Azar, Gada, Eshmon, Beth Pellet, Azar, Shul, Bathsheba, Busy Ophria, Bela, Lim, Izim, Eltalad, Chisel, Homer, Sitla, Madmanna, Sanshan Na, Libaf, Shilam, Ain, and Remnon. All the cities of 29 were their villages. In the lowland, Eshtal, Zora, Achsna, Zanoa, En, Ganem, Tap, Pua, Enam, Jarmuth, Adlam, Soka, Azika, Saim, Adifim, and Gidara, or Gidara Frim. Fourteen cities with their villages. Zina, Ada Asha, Migdal, Gad, Dalin, Mispa, Zokfil, Lashi, Boskaf, Eglon, Kabon, Lamam, Cheslesh, Gidorov, Beftogon, Nama, Makeda, sixteen cities with their villages. Libna, Efer, Eshan, Ifta, Ashna, Nizib, Kila, Akzib, Masha, nine cities with their villages. Ekron, with its towns and its villages, from Ekron even to the sea. All that were by the side of Ashton, their villages, Ashton, its towns and its villages, Gaza, its towns and its villages, the book of Egypt, a great sea with its coastline. In the hill country, Shemir, Jeter, Sokar, Denar, Karaf, Sana, Jizdeba, Anab, Estimo, Anamim, Yashan, Anon, and Glow, eleven cities with their villages. Arab, Duma, Ishan, Janam, Beth, Tapua, Afika, Umta, Kriff, Arba, also called Ebron, and Zio, nine cities with their villages. Moran, Kamal, Zif, Zuta, Zizuil, Jok, Diem, Zan, Awa, Cain, Kibia, and Timna, ten cities with their villages. Hanu, Bafzur, Gida, Maraf, Baf Anof, and El Tikon, six cities with their villages. Griff Baal, also called Griff Jerem, and Abal, two cities with their villages. In the wilderness, Baf Araba, Midden, Shika Ka, Nibshan, the city of Salt, and Engadi, six cities with their villages. As for the Jebusites, the inhabitants of Jerusalem, the children of Judah couldn't drive them out. But the Jebusites live with the children of Judah at Jerusalem to this day. Mm-hmm.